Uh, hello, Garf. First of all, congratulations on behalf of Masterclass Space. Uh, we are very happy to know that you have uh, got a really great uh, bitset score. 414 is really amazing. So, for our viewers, I would like to have your formal introduction. So, kindly provide your formal introduction for our viewers, please. I am Garv Nagori and I scored 414 marks in Bitsat 2021 and I, in JE mains I got 99.95 percentile and I also got under top 100 on top top 500 ranking KVPY. That's great. And where are you from Garv? I am from Mumbai, Maharashtra. So, okay. So great. You are from Mumbai, Maharashtra. Bollywood city. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. want want to ask you a few things about your preparation. First, I talk about academics. Then we'll talk about something else also, like your hobbies, passions, and your career things. That's something also which we are going to talk about. First, let's focus on the preparation. Talk, talking specifically about Bitset, you took Master Class Space Bitset test series. So, I just want to ask you. What's your feedback regarding the test series? How was your uh, you know experience? What score you are getting in our test series, and what you have finally achieved? Could you please let us know? Yeah, that Bitset test series of Masterclass Space was very very helpful and very nice. It also helped us help me prepare for the actual exam, and the scores I got in that exam were very similar to what I got in the Bitset. I was like getting around four hundred ten to four twenty only, and that is what I ended up getting in Bitset. And um, the English section and the language, the language and the logical reasoning section were also very great. And that helped very, very much for the actual examination also. That's great. That's great. So 410, 420. So average comes out to be 415. And exactly 414. You, you are there. Hmm. 414. That's great. So it was like um, taking another mock test. Yes. Good, 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 good. So it gives you a lot of confidence, I believe. That uh, yeah, yeah. You, you you are already there, fine. So I I just want to know you you are preparing since uh, last two years, and uh, uh, specifically you are studying physics, chemistry, and mathematics. Uh, English and logical reasoning is something which is not taught in institutes. Okay. Hmm. So I want to know, and many m many students they ask us how to prepare for English and logical reasoning. Definitely, we have our test series, but from your point of view, how one should prepare for English and logical reasoning? Uh, for me personally, I studied English and logical reasoning after I gave mock tests of masterclass space, and I also saw some pre PYQs from which had previous year papers, and those were all those are very helpful, and in my opinion, those should be enough to cover both those both of the subjects. Correct. Correct. Actually, those are not exactly the previous year. They are memory based because bit set doesn't yeah, come. Up, uh, bit set doesn't come. Otherwise, many of the students are in dilemma, and they are confused. How come someone can uh, get uh, the bit set test series of previous year? It's a memory based. Yeah, memory based. Correct. Correct. In correct. some guidebook. Fine. Fine. I just want to ask you. Did you find any special feature, anything a very special, uh, anything you liked specifically in the art test series? Yeah, the performance analysis was very, very helpful and very well written. And also those sections in which it was written, how well I performed with respect to other candidates and how difficult the question actually was. And, and there were some uh, parts in which it was written. How did I manage my time well? That also helped very much. Over on the okay, so you, over on you like the analysis section analysis part yes. has proved to be very helpful for you. Yes, that's great. That's great. So now since you are done with uh, uh, two year preparation, you are done with uh, your bit set. You have got really great score. What advice do you have for the juniors who are going to you know take this exam next year? How to prepare? Uh, just uh, prepare for JE Advanced. It will be helpful for BitSat also. And the, just, the, just the last month before BitSat, you should start with English and logical reasoning. Otherwise, most of the JE Advanced syllabus covers this. And um, that's it. That's great. But one, one factor is there. 
that uh, you have to be really fast in bits at right yeah 150 question and if you go for bonus plus to n in 80 minutes so i believe that that is something which requires you know good number of practice yes good so now uh, from the academics i just want to move to something else what do you want to do in your career what do you want to pursue finally i want to pursue computer science in iit bombay actually mm mm-hmm. that's great and and uh, w- yeah. w- w- what do you wish to you know i mean uh, that is computer science i mean that's the degree which you are going to do finally mm. w- what's your aim is you know s- s- someone wants to become ia someone wants to become scientist someone wants to become xyz whatever so in long term what are your long term planning in terms of career which you would like to take most of the students they, they want to be entrepreneurs so have you have you thought something about it not really but <laughs> okay now mind which time you you can get to know that's great so mm. no, 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 it is it is good that you want to you, you should give time to you should give time to choose your career rather than you know just starting that i specifically want to become like this good so gar what are your hobbies by the way uh i like to read books and i also like to cycle a lot i also used to play football very much that's great that's great so uh, th- this reading of book what kind of books definitely you are reading much that's why you got 414 is it physics chemistry <laughs> mathematics <laughs> not only that i also like to read fiction and sometimes uh, some science novels mm, science fiction yes good good so uh, uh, and uh, during these two years how was your schedule i mean the, uh, uh, how uh, how much time did you uh, did you devote to study every day approximately uh, approximately 8 to 9 hours every day and uh, in the after the syllabus was over at least 10 hours every day so this is definitely uh, the viewers should understand that uh, this much time is required at mm. least that, that is also at least in between do, it, it, did you follow some things uh, uh, some means of you know uh, activity to relax uh i just used to spend time on my phone and sometimes i used i used to go down to play with my friends mm. so that is also very much important obviously yes correct 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 so good to know on these things that uh, along with this you are you, you also had uh, you, you have spent some time in the hobbies uh, uh do, do you plan to pursue something in terms of hobbies in uh, college in college i would mostly like to, uh, to play football mostly and cycle also cycle also and so uh, would you like to take it on a very good level that you start uh, participating in some competition because you know these top universities they they have a lot of competitions yeah. a lot of exposure so do you have some plans to you know take it to a great a next level uh, not really some particular plans but maybe if i get into a um, i get into iit i will definitely do that that's great that's please great. try to do that so good to know about your plans and i wish you uh, great luck in pursuing uh, your degree and great luck for j advance also thank you so much for thank being you. with us thank, thank you, you. bye bye